welcome back to the channel welcome back to Tommy's homestead garden so this is just another short video y'all <laughs> I'm trying to bring it to you another short video um, so that I'll have material out one because I probably won't feel like recording next week so I'm just trying to do and stack my videos as much as I can so these containers right here oh before I begin if you are new to my channel I want to welcome all of my new subscribers and all of my returning subscribers if you are undecided and haven't yet hit that red button go ahead and subscribe to the channel also everyone make sure y'all like the video because that helps me with YouTube so these right here are red shed 24 inch rectangle planters they were $4.99. I got these from Tractor Supply. And I was like, oh God, I got to drill holes in here. So I went looking for the drill. And y'all, my husband took the drill with him. So that means, you know what that means? Tommy got to buy her own drill. Because we're not going to be splitting these drills up. Okay, so fortunately for me, inside of this, you see that black dot right there? Well, that's a plug, and that allows the water to drain. But I kind of feel like because of the length of this, and I'm just gonna pull that part right there out, just like that. And now you see I have a drainage hole. But I just feel like it should be a drainage hole here and here. So I don't have the drill. So I do have a screwdriver, and I'm gonna see if that works. If it doesn't, then I'm just gonna do it as is without and go ahead and put my soil in. Oh Lord, look, y'all, you see how that cracked up right there? So I gotta be gentle. So anyway, it has a slit in it now, y'all. So, and there it has one there. Works for me, it's just a planter. So I already have my flowers labeled on my little sticks here and today I'm doing cyanus mixed colors which will be this one right here and then I'm also doing Shasta Daisy this one right here and I'm gonna try to spread it out because I don't feel like it's a lot of seeds in here y'all so I'm about to take this one out as well and put a little split in this one. And all I did was split it so water can drain. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and add my soil and plant these seeds. And I'm gonna put these on my front porch on the banister. And so I was supposed to be making my raised beds and because of that, I'm just going to do this right here, Sunday. And whatever get on the table, we'll get straight with one of these things here. pretty deep I could actually plant some um, I probably could plant something else in here I might go back and get some more of these and just have some food and flowers on the front porch as well I did that last year but I haven't done it yet for this year I'm just doing everything in the backyard y'all so that is looking lovely Now let me get, I always feel like, let's take the top little layer off and I'm going to use that same top layer to cover it back up, the seeds, but not real deep. So now I'm going to put the cyanus in here, so I'm going to go ahead and put this one in here because I am very forgetful. Y'all know that by now, right? So, 
I'll show you these seeds. Here are the seeds. Hopefully you can see them. I just dropped a couple and I'm about to get them right now and put them on in there. So I'm just gonna sprinkle them so that they cover the whole planter. These are some weird looking seeds here. Oh, go away, B. Well, don't go too far, but just go away from me. How about that? So now I'm gonna take the soil that I just took out, sprinkle it over the seeds I just put in here lightly, because you don't want too much uh, soil on the top because it'll take your seeds a while to show for you. So, I think that's good. Got everything covered. Great. I'm gonna just drop my stick. My back is killing me. Oh, I love the soil. So, you can see I still have soil in here. I'll move that one over here. I'm going to water it. I'm, I'm going to water it, but I'm going to wait until I get it on the front porch. That way I'm not wetting up my clothes. So now I'm going to add soil to that one. So I'm going to have to bust open a bag. Like when we first met, oh, I don't care, it's getting too late. I want you and I can't wait. Don't want to spend a minute without you. I know you feel the same. So come on, give me love. I'm going to show you how to move, how to move with my body. Come hit me with your touch and make me want to say, damn. And yeah, you know what's up. Ain't nothing I won't do, I won't do for your body. So give me all you got right now I know I'm yours, baby So come give me love You know you're mine, baby So come give me love I never felt nothing quite like this I get a high every time we kiss Can't get enough, baby So come give me love All of your love, I can't fake it when I'm with you, my legs go weak, hey. Can you hear it? I think my heart just skipped a beat, hey. This feeling is getting so strong. Love me till the morning, love me all night long. There's something special about you. You're the one that I want. So come on, give me love. I'ma show you how to move, how to move with my body. Come hit me with your touch and make me want to say. So y'all, this is my front yard right here. I'm trying not to get my house number in here. But I love these trees right here, but they got to be cut down some. Um, and I need to do it now because last year I cut too low and it was a bird's nest in there. And she never came back for her babies and my fault. So I got to get that cleaned up. But it, this is a wraparound this is a wraparound porch so as you can see right here i'm gonna cut these down i actually these grow pretty easy so when i cut them i'm gonna plant them and i'm gonna put them in the backyard in a planter container so my porch wraps around and i don't have any chairs out here my husband is really the only one that come out here but now then i'll come and sit with him um and chill but you see where i have that planter at and i got the other one right there um they're there right now and i'm about to water them but i'm gonna place them on the ground because i'm scared that the wind might blow them over or something because it may not be heavy enough so let's get started 
Oh, and over here, minus the cigarette butts of my husband, I these were I had my strawberries in, y'all, and I just noticed. Can you see that? This was just sitting like I really was gonna throw this away. And look, I have not watered this thing in I don't know how long. So they're about to get watered as well. It's my little oh can see if I can do this with. Ooh. I don't know if I can do this. Let me put this on a stand. Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. 